YouTube. Hello, this is Minecraft Made in Austria. Welcome back to a new episode here in my single player world. As you can see, I'm still at the gold farm area. We built this huge gold farm last episode. And I did a bit of work since then. Not, not really much. I just went ahead and connected all four sides connected the hopper chain to the middle here they all just end here in the in midair for now I wanna connect them to a sorting and storage system hopefully today so that's all I did all four sides let's quickly check if that's working um, where's my lever I I put it on the um, underneath the block so that I can later on switch it from the storage system down here. Now it should be on. Let's quickly check. Yeah, pistons are firing. So let's do a uh, okay, let me climb back up and then we do a quick test run of the farm, see if all four sides, all the loot gets transported into the middle and then we can start doing some more stuff here. Okay, I'm back up here. So let's quickly shoot one of these guys. You. Oh, he died instantly, wow. Okay, that worked. Let some of them drop down on all four sides. Okay. Should be good. Let's go down here. Bum, bum, bum. Let's see where we can reach. Hoppers, uh, maybe from down here. Okay, yeah. Can't oh, well, now I have to be careful because these guys will try to get me. Just check this side. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Oh, there's another hopper. Can I reach it? Really? Okay. Which one did I miss? Yeah, I think, yeah, all four sides are working, so items get transported in the middle. Perfect! But before I start the storage system, I want to do a better way up here because I had to climb this ladder, yeah, like a thousand times and it's the most annoying thing in the whole wild world so yeah this has to go I wanna do an elevator up there and I already pre 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 prepared something I did the, at the beginning of the elevator already <coughs> and for those who don't know there's a new trick since 1.9 came out with pistons you can now suck um, mobs or players through pistons and I have it already prepared the first step so when I step on this pressure plate I will get sucked through the piston and end up on top of it and if you chain like pistons all together here would be the next one suck me on the next one and so on and so on until we are up there so what I'm gonna do now is build a torch tower and at the same time on my way up remove this stupid ladder so I'm just gonna alternate these blocks and put a torch on it so that we can get the signal all the way up and when I'm up there, 
I'll show you the next step. Alrighty, torch tower is done. <coughs> I'm sorry for my weird noise. I just had a sneeze attack. <laughs> had to sneeze like 50 times. Bruh. Bruh. Well, yeah, that's the torch tower. This is how it looks like. All the way up. Already looks cooler than the ladder. But we didn't build it for the looks. We wanna get a good transportation. <coughs> so let's come down here. I already showed you the first piston. And now what I have to do is just place the next piston and it should go against this torch, I guess. Let's test it. Mm, no. Oh yeah, now it worked. Cool. So all I have to do now, let's build a second temporary tower here is place the pistons against the torches all the way up so i'm gonna do that and then we can already test this elevator cool Ta -da! Yeah, that's pretty much a 10,000 times faster and cooler way than climbing up this stupid ladder. There's only one thing I did change. As I showed you in the previous clip, I had these pistons spaced out one, so I had it every other block. And I changed that to two apart, so two blocks in between. That seems to be more reliable. It's a bit slower, but yeah, still a pretty cool way to get up here. And this is working 100%. Pretty happy with it. It's only three by one. So really cool design. And yeah, that's our new way up. Maybe I'll decorate it later on on the side here a bit but for now this is cool as it is and now we get up there and do some work to collect our gold and here we are I built a new platform with a glass floor so that we can look down not much to see there but maybe later we build something down there I don't know yet and we have these four little wings which will all look the same and here's the chests I have them arranged like that we have some hidden lighting under the chests like here so here will be the chests on all four sides and here I already started with the sorting system so the hoppers just go over and yeah your basic sorting system still have to build the rest and set up the filters I'm not sure yet what I wanna keep well of course the nuggets and the ingots about the rotten flesh I'm not sure maybe I try to transport a cleric villager up here will that will be a pain and I'm not sure how I'm gonna do that but if I can manage it manage to get him up here it would be cool to save the rotten flesh as well in one one column because then we can trade it for emeralds and yeah that's pretty much it so here's the middle and I have my lever on this side and on the other side I managed to cramp in a 
a minecart so that I can continue a minecart elevator here to the top and if I want I can jump out here to access the redstone so worked out pretty cool yeah here's the the hopper line it comes here I still have to connect it but first I want to finish the filters so yeah that's how we're sitting right now I think um, the next thing would be to try and get a villager up here because this will mm, decide if we keep rotten flesh or not and then I can set up the filters hmm. I'm not sure if I want to do that it's such a pain moving villagers mm -hmm. But yeah, let's let's try. Well, that was a lot easier than I thought it would be. Smoothly. That went really smoothly. Just pushed him into the elevators and up he, got, up he went. Nice. Okay, so now... Yeah, still possible to trade with him. That's cool. Maybe I change the look of it later, I just had to trap him for now. And here's how we're gonna do it. First column will be rotten flesh so that we can access it and trade right away. Then nuggets, 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 nuggets. And last one golden ingots because they are pretty rare and we don't get them as often. So four with nuggets, one for ingots, one for rotten flesh. So I think I'll set up the filters and maybe the next step then would be to connect it and let the farm run for a while and test it out, see if the, the item sorting works. Oh yeah, of course I also have to build an overflow item dropping out thingy wingy because we get these stupid golden swords all the time and we have to throw them right away destroy them I'm not sure how I'm gonna fit the redstone in here maybe I have to transport them a bit further and then dispense them into lava would be the best way I could just drop them down but then we have thousands and thousands of items down there and <coughs> I want to reduce the lag as much as possible so I'm not gonna do that that's also one thing I wanted to do yeah I'm I'll play around a bit here <laughs> 
just so happy that we got this village up here. Maybe for the next, because now I want one on all all the side on on each side. And I think for the next one, I'm gonna set up my camera account and watch him go up the elevator. Would be really funny to see that. I think at least. But yeah. As I said, I'm gonna do some more work here and meet you back when I had more when I have more done. Cool. Alright, next progress update. My villager has a new friend, so that's cool. And I finished pretty much two sides. So this one and this one should be all done. Let me quickly show you. Yeah, here's, here I have my filters, first one rotten flesh, then nuggets, 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 and gold ingots, and all the other crap, like mostly the golden swords, will go on, and they, uh, where can I show you, yeah, they make a turn here, go back, and get into this dropper, and every time there is an item in this dropper, I have this little clock here. Not the most beautiful redstone, but it works. So everything that comes into this hopper will get dropped into the lava and destroyed immediately. So that's cool. I also went ahead and slapped most of the blocks that don't have redstone on it. So I can reduce the pigment spawning here in this redstone area yeah everything connected up should work fine um, the lava is far enough from the ice so this ice tray here won't won't melt that's also good and now I would say we test it out see if those two sides work fine everything gets sorted correctly so let's switch the farm on. Eat two slices of melon. Yeah, this item elevator is a bit sloppy because of this redstone torch here is right above. And when you click, you sometimes hit this torch and then won't get into the minecart. But yeah. It works and it's better than a ladder. Later on I can continue it all the way up so that we have another quick way to the top here, to the AFK spot. Okay, get my bow out. Get on my glass block here. And go! No, <laughs> my bow is too strong. They always die with one shot. Yeah. Okay. Let it run for a few seconds to collect some stuff. Uh oh. I think I broke something. Yep, definitely broke something. La, 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 la. Let me have a look here. I have to do some maintenance. All right, like a test. I just messed up the timing a bit when I worked around here in the redstone area. So let's try this again. Now it should work. Pigment die. And boom. XP gets shut up. Okay, perfect. The only thing now is I have to be really careful in case any pigmen are spawning down here. 
because they will wreck my face. Oh, I can already hear one. Oh, they're everywhere. Oh, no, 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 no. Let's get over here. Aren't you angry? Hello? Bye bye. Okay. Let's watch our bag and have a look here. So in the first one should be rotten flesh. Perfect. Nuggets, nice. Of course this will be empty. They will fill up when this one is full. And we have ingots. Perfect. Let's have a look on the other side. Rotten flesh. Nuggets, empty, 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 and 32 ingots? What? Why so many? They must have fallen down from my inventory or something. That's a bit, that's almost, no, that's more than the nuggets. But I'm not complaining. This is working. Now I have to do the other two sides and think of a, of a nice design here. I have to hide this and so on and so on. I still have to get three villagers up here. But all in all, I'm pretty happy with the progress. Yeah, let's do some more. Hey guys, I spend a lot more time here. As you can see I'm at level 131, so I let the farm run for a while. And I really love this place. And I also did some more work down there. Finally, I have a project that I would consider as finished. So normally I'm better at starting projects all over the place and not finish one but this guy pretty much done it's working perfectly so here i have this minecart elevator yeah some pigmen are down here but that's not a problem okay that's that's the storage room and let me turn the volume a bit down Okay, so here's what I did. I have three villagers, three clerics to trade the rotten flesh and get some emeralds out of them. Then on the right side I have some, some extra storage for emeralds or if I want to craft gold blocks later on I can store them back here. Crafting table and ender chest, that's the same on all four sides. I already showed you the other side with the storage chests. 
and here on the oh, that's those three sides and here I have our first nugget <laughs> we claimed in the in the last episode that's the first nugget we got out of this farm and some some anvils if I wanna repair some tools with my levels I get here yeah simple design it's the same on all four sides I like it down here and it's pretty much spawn safe I rarely get a pigment down here but that's really rare yeah pretty much safe down here that's the elevator coming up you already know that and to exit this place I just stand on this iron pressure plates press the button fly down with my elytra wings and boom there you go pretty cool I have it on all four sides again and yeah I don't think there's much more to say so here's mm. it's a bit hard to catch the the minecart but yeah if you get in the first one it's really easy to get up Bam, and you're up here and can operate the farm again really really cool and get down again just fall through the minecarts and here we are then press the button go through and fly down just like that yep loving it and finally a finished project really really cool i hope you like this episode hope I'll see you next time. Thank you very much for watching. Bye bye.